that to make way for, yes, another bank. The wrecking crew began its countdown about 6 o'clock this morning. They will be using sirens to indicate how close we're getting. About 15 seconds before the blast, we will hear three short blasts. Police and fire officials, of course, keeping people away, a two-block area having been barricaded off for safety. You can see some of the people down, uh, down along the river now. We estimate four to 500 people are, uh, are gathering now to watch this. They'll see something that you just, you don't see very often. As I said, the last one was about three and a half years ago. Hard to believe that it will take only six seconds for this building to fall in upon itself. What the wrecking company does is put the dynamite in the columns of the building, and they wire the columns to the walls, and as the columns explode, they pull the walls in onto uh, the inside. And that keeps the debris right in that lot area, and of course, it's a very safe way to bring a building down. Temperatures hovering right around the freezing mark in San Antonio. No wind, though. Rooftop vantage points for some people around. Trying to get the best possible picture. There will be a lot of cameras clicking at this event, too. Already on top of the building where we are, there are uh, probably about a dozen, including uh, newspaper photographers and uh, people that just want to capture the event for their own. I suspect we may be delayed just a bit. Not quite sure why. Police helicopter flying around uh, the immediate downtown area, keeping watch from the air for any possible trouble spots. Police and fire officials uh, told New Center Force Barbara Bedrick this morning that uh, they were having no problems with uh, crowd control. Things were proceeding pretty much as planned. The company that's demolishing the building, the Wells Wrecking Company, headquartered in Oklahoma City in Dallas, has quite a bit of experience at, at this. Uh, the president of the firm telling me that They've demolished about 200 buildings in the last eight years. When I asked the president what his favorite uh, demolition job was, he told me it was a pair of twin smokestacks in Oklahoma City. Oh, I've just got word now that, in fact, the, uh, the helicopter I was referring to was not San Antonio police helicopter. It's an unauthorized helicopter, and that they're trying to get that out of the area. That could account for why we're a little past schedule. Because if there is anyone or anything in the uh, two-block safety area, as they call it, they cannot demolish that building. So that could well account for the holdup. That chopper's headed out now. We haven't heard those warning sirens yet. That helicopter leaving the area now. 